I would think he's got the hot hand right now or they get the ball in his hand and he has enough time to facilitate something. Joe Ingles will inbound. Looking for a cutter. Fires it off to Hayward on a dribble, on a step back. The jumper. Yes! Bedlam! The new money man knocks down the winner against Cleveland. How many times has Hayward been in this situation last year where he did not come through? What a shot from Hayward. LeBron James falls down. He gets the shot up. This is going to count. Nothing. Point one remaining. Darrell Arthur looking for the baseball pass. He's got Moutier. Moutier lets it go. He got it. He got it. But was it in time? Watch the orange light. Is the ball out of his hands? Bobble. Oh, it's yes. out. It's out. It is out. Emmanuel Moutier. They'll review. It is confirmed, yes! Lopez, Evan Turner gets it back. Turner rolling in! Get in there! Yes! Bounds play. Spencer Hawes gets the ball. Dribble handoff. Evan Turner turning the corner, not dissuaded by the lack of foul calls. Puts the pressure on the Nets to be at their best, and he gets the kind bounce. Losing streak over. One of the things I'm thinking about is you possibly set a few screens for Joe Johnson. If not there, get a dive to the basket. 1.3 left. Nets down two. Johnson gets a shot off. Johnson makes it happen once again with no time left. So as he said, they're trying to get Brooke down low with the basketball. An unbelievable shot. Just an unbelievable shot. Johnson at the horn. Bang. Wins it. 1.5 remaining. James for the win. It's gone. LeBron stuns the Chicago Bulls and the series is tied at two games apiece what a finish here at the United Center for the second straight game of buzzer beater James who has struggled with his jump shot throughout the playoffs nails it from the corner And no question getting it off in time. Friday night, the Bulls with the buzzer beater. And here's Sunday afternoon, James with the road win. And they'll head back to Cleveland all even at two games apiece. Nine tenths left. A three wins the series. It's Lillard. He got the shot off. Lillard, no! First time in 14 years! Of course, it's being reviewed because it goes in at triple zero, but it's out, it's over, and the Portland Trailblazers, in shocking fashion, when they didn't hit one outside shot in the fourth quarter, get the kid with the big guts.
to win the series. Damian Lillard sends Portland to the second round. Ariza gives it up to Harden, and here we go. Tucker gives him some room. He probably won't get a foul call. You don't get many in this situation in the NBA. Five seconds. Down to four. Three. Down to two. Harden puts it up. He got it! The beard! Cold-blooded three to win the game! It's over! Cold-blooded shot for James Harden! To win it! Check it again. Steps back and fires and hits. And there's no time left on the clock. That's it. Everybody go home, especially you Houston fans, go home happy. As James Harden. Seconds difference between the two clocks. Tell you what, Brandon Knight's been the guy. I, I, if I'm uh, Jeff Hornacek, I might be giving him the ball. Bledsoe races to the corner for three. Rebound back up. Wow. With three tenths of wow. a second left. What a play that was oh, by Toledovich. Wow. Offensive oh, rebound. My goodness. Well, first of all, they got what they wanted. A good look out yes. of the corner. And the Bulls dodged that bullet. But Ooh, watch got here. a wide open look. And then no, I mean, Toledovich just went over the top. And and got that offensive rebound. Wow. 103 101 with three tenths of a second left. Now, think about this, Stacey. Phoenix had a, uh, was tied last night. The exact shot and what we saw last year. And from six feet away, he's leaping and passing the ball. That's a mistake. 2.6 seconds to go now. Blake Griffin will turn, shoot a three for the win, bounce, it goes, he got it, he got the big win, it goes. <laughs> Can you believe it? We thought it was three. Here, here it is again. We're going to watch it. Blake Griffin. Oh, he steps behind. Great. Holy smokes. <laughs> what a bounce. What a bounce. It doesn't have enough trajectory to go in, does it? It hits the front of the rim. I guess it's his night. Man, oh man, his second three of the game is not official yet. Tom Washington takes off. Now it's a three-point basket. Clippers win. It's official. One of the most unlikely finishes you'll ever see in a regular season NBA game. <laughs> Steve Bomber. And Mike, this is usually when the Bulls have Pau Gasol as their outlet to throw the ball into. Late. With him out hurt, Gibson's got to make sure he can catch it cleanly, put it on the floor and make a play if no one else is available. Dunleavy. Looking. Finds Rose. Rose trying to get open, fires away! Bang! It's over! The Bulls win at the buzzer! Tomorrow night, a spectacular finish as Derrick Rose banks it in at the buzzer. Bedlam here at the United Center. Tristan Thompson right on top of him. Guys, what an amazing finish. Mama, there goes that man. Final score, 99-96 for Jeff Van Gundy, Mark Jackson, Lisa Saunders, producer Chip Corrigan, director Jimmy Moore, and our entire crew. Mike said, Mike Breed say, let's go to game three to LA and join Mike Tirico and UB Brown. Singler finds Westbrook. Thompson on him. Westbrook. Back out Singler. Shot clock at seven. Westbrook on the drive, falling away. 
won't go. Rebound taken by Iguodala. They do have a timeout. Decide not to use it. Curry, way downtown. Bang! Bang! Oh, what a shot from Curry! With six tenths of a second remaining. The brilliant shooting of Stephen Curry continues. And he ties the NBA record with his 12th three-pointer of the game. Westbrook gets off a decent look, the banker. And you've got to press up. Robertson just a little late, but that's just... <laughs> Man, that's about 35 feet out, well beyond the 28-foot mark. And now with six tenths of a second remaining. It's a three Comes Pierce with five seconds left. Pierce with three. Pierce with two. Pierce fall away at the horn. It's gone. Paul Pierce does it again as the Wizards win it. 103. 101. How's that for a finish? You blow a 20. to win it for the Wizards, his first points of the fourth quarter. There's the switch, Schroeder's on him now. Watch Kent Bazemore come into the picture though. He's gonna try and pressure, that's great pressure. That's just an impossible shot, but that's why they call that man the truth. You called and said you can't leave him and they got that switch, which you mentioned. Schroeder on Pierce, they blow a 21 point lead, yet they win it as time expires. To take a 2-1 series lead. That's all John Wall can do is celebrate. John Wall was just... Anderson to inbound it. DeRozan, Calderon, Ross, and Amir. Here's Jose. Three seconds. Gets it to DeRozan. DeRozan's fading. What a tough shot. And it goes. It goes. DeMar DeRozan wins it. The Toronto Raptors finally get it to go. And they are going to take a look to see if it went, but there was no more of a difficult shot than that. Fading away toward the bench of Orlando. It is under video review. And he definitely got it. And the Raptors can board their bus, head to the airport, jump on a plane, and head home. Good catch and shoot, 1.2. It'll come in, and will it get in? It'll be Anthony Davis at the buzzer. Yes! Yes! Oh! Anthony Davis comes Whoa. through at the buzzer. Everybody is stunned. It looked like it was off in time. And wow. the Pelicans <laughs> are going to walk out as they look at it with a three-boy win. He had to double clutch it. That's the tough part because it, with a double clutch, did it leave his fingertips in time? That is a good question. An amazing, and it looks like it was out in time. The double clutch on the flyby. Yes, Pelicans, Pelicans take win. the season series Pelicans over win. Oklahoma City for the first time since the 2008-2009 season. The as fans, good a finish, David, as we'll ever see. The fans do not want to go home. The fans do not want to go home. They can't believe it. Kid's got some game. Yes, he does. <laughs> a pump fake three from 35 feet. Double clutch. Letting Durant go by. Butler will inbound. Gets it into Kawhi Leonard. Aaron Gordon is on Leonard. It out, everybody on the baseline. Four on the clock. Leonard crossing over. Firing the jumper. He got it with less than a the game winner. But Peyton had a chance. Let's take another look. Hand up in his face. Leonard just too good.